Hey guys. Oh, hold on. Look, oh, yeah. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. This is I, I get again. You don't know. Welcome back, welcome back. Uh, yeah. Don't know. Some Palo Santo. CH. And something to clear the energy aside. Yeah. Anyways, no. This morning we will talk about um, the purpose of life, right? Now this, the purpose of life is a thing where we've been, you know, misinterpreted by a lot of human beings because we are not really conscious about life and purpose and one bag of shit, you know, because we're too conscious. That's how we can make ourselves miserable and we can make ourselves, you know. We're just too conscious, and consciousness is that thing where can be a blessing and a curse, you know, level of consciousness. When you're too conscious of certain things, you know, that's why them say belief kill and belief cure. Belief is being conscious of things. When I believe something, it's like seeing something is being conscious of it. You see this light as you're conscious of the light, you know. Awareness is consciousness, right? So, it can be a blessing and a curse, as we all know, because human beings make <laughs> the level of consciousness cause them to live in a misery fear and a lot of things where we create for ourselves, you know, in our mind. <laughs> we really try to not really exist but we create in our mind and suffer because like things that we tell ourselves, things that we believe about ourselves, you know. We really and truly not exist. People don't think that way. But we create it and you know things that people think that and it's a whole damn effect. Now the purpose of life, me didn't even get it confused at one point, you know, in my life because growing up all me around me is like one bag of people where all them talk about, all them sing about because it's not the music too all them talk about or all them fucking sing about from parents down to fucking anything everywhere you're looking at society you know, in our era we were growing up it is all about money so it's easy for a child in this time you know, things that the purpose of life is to just make as much money as you possibly can it is easy for a child to think that, and that's what I thought when I was younger, you know, we just say, yo, shit, we live the purpose of life is to make a lot of money then, we we'll just make as much as we can, you know? <laughs> and, you make a girl could drive for work hard and to try to make money and we try to, you know, you get a drive, okay, I think that was what life is about. Now, the more you grow, you realize, say, shit, that is not the sole purpose of life, really. Yes, making money is nice. It's nice to make money, everybody know that, of course, you like to buy nice things, you know, it's nice to see a lot of money, you know, it's abundant, like, you like, like to see a lot of numbers in your account, I understand that, but you have to understand that's a stage of life, and that's a part of it, you know, so you can't just stop one place all your life, you know, I understand that some people like school, but they wouldn't want to go to school all their life, you know, they like a biscuit, they wouldn't want to just sit and eat a biscuit every day. You know, you like ice cream, you wouldn't just want to eat ice cream every single day. It's an experience where you like. And you just like it, kind of experience. But that not means you have a sit down and make it be the whole, um, the sole purpose of your life. And then you find yourself a stress. If you can't get a spoon of ice cream, you bring in all that stress. When you see something start to have so much control over you, you start to stress over it, people. Check yourself. You really and truly to start to check, like, yo, I want this, you know. It's not become a slave to the thing and that's the whole problem with the monetary system. Nothing is wrong with making money. Nothing is wrong, you know. But don't become a slave to the thing and that is what a lot of people been doing. Some people fucking, some people will kick you out of them house. Literally will kick you out. Because of money. <laughs> the vibes that I love not do no more. I love for the human that did it. The money, the, the um, Money is not wealth, you know. I know people don't get it. Money is just a measure of value. It's a measure of value and a medium of exchange. That is what it is. That is what that is the definition of money, you know. And if it, you can make a medium of exchange and a measure of value, and make you a kick out all your children out of the house <laughs> and them shit then. You can you can make a measure of value and make you kick out your partner. You can make a measure of value make you kill an next person. Literally take a life over the fact that somebody owe you some money or whatever it's a measure of value life way more important than that and that is the thing human beings have lost 
you know, they lost them connection, they lose the purpose of life, they don't know what the purpose, you know, so if you don't know the purpose of life, you have to go around like a chicken and doing one bag of shit, and that is what causes the world to look like they look now. People lose the purpose, they don't know the purpose of life, you know. You know the purpose of life is simply to be happy, to be happy and just living in your flow, that's the purpose of life, to be happy and living in your flow, that's it, because even if I say the purpose of life is evolution, which is truly the purpose of life, evolution, that's it. Truly, the true purpose of life is evolution. But then if I say that now, some people say, oh, you cannot evolve. You know, yeah, you cannot evolve, but you evolve through experiences. That's why you, 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 that's why you chose to incarnate here. Because you never come here um, like by chance. You chose to incarnate in physical form to go through experiences for evolution, for the purpose of growth evolution that's it but while you are here you should be happy and you should be comfortable you know if you are stressed you know if you are worried and things they bring you away from the path of evolution because when you are stressed and worry you actually go backwards nobody who are stressed and worry now go forward we never see that yet if you are stressed and a worry is a backward that is a backward thing you do because you cannot stress and worry about no you only can stress and worry about things that happen to you already and based upon things that happen to you already you worry and stress so it probably happen to you again and then shit there you, 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 you create shit in your mind for worry about and cause you to stress and cause you to lose the purpose of life because you miss it you know the purpose of life is not to worry you know it's to be happy you know it's to be happy and to be comfortable so if you find yourself a worry, it's because you're not do. You know, you know, you, you miss the purpose. You're not doing what you're supposed to do. That's why you're worried. That's why you find yourself being depressed. You're not doing what you're supposed to do. It's simple. We don't come here for worry. Worrying is not a natural human trait. No. <laughs> you see any other animals I'm out there worry? And if you think of me and tell, the purpose of life is not to make as much money as you possibly can. Why? Look out in the nature, people. No money not out there, no physical um no money not out there for their spend. They can't buy no or they can't acquire no monetary wealth. The animals them. You see them worry? No really look and tell me, do you see the animals worrying? Do you see them living miserable? No. A human alone are live miserable. Even in the Sahara, the desert, the fucking animals them. Even when they see the sun as a beak, and even though when they see the lion and all the gizel, the gizel in a fucking Heard him is not a miserable gazelle. Him happy for most of the time. <laughs> you get to me, him happy. He just when they come, he not even conscious of fucking dead. So he not even worry about it. When they come, it comfy, simple. And then gone with it. He not worry. He not try to fight nothing. Human being so fucking conscious that them try to fight things and then try to work against things and then stress out themselves because it, you know they just not get it. We really and truly don't have free will, people. That is what I'm trying to tell you. You don't have any free will, and free will is an illusion. You come here and you are governed by the fucking universe. You can't do nothing. You can't even, you can't even breathe without the universe say you're supposed to breathe. That is how powerful it is. You can't even wake up if the universe has ever wake up. You get to me so the fact you wake up this fucking morning is a, is a, is a, is a sign. If you use it as a sign, every day you get to breathe, every breath you take, you have to make it be a sign to you. Say, yo. I still have work to do. I day have something. I day have some purpose. Because I never have to wake up. You never have to wake up this morning. Who tell you that? You never have to wake up. You think that you wake up yourself? <laughs> and then you think say, you have to worry about things. If I never you wake up yourself, if I never you bring yourself into this reality, you spend nine months in the womb not worrying about anything. You don't even conscious of nothing before you actually there. And even when you're born, you don't conscious of nothing really until you reach like four, five, or even three, maybe two. To some people so why you come here and worry about things and I make things bother you and I make monetary worries make things like money stress you out and not having enough money stress you out or not having a house and a car stress you out that's not the purpose of life and then people here that's what they want you to do they want you to worry they want you to stress to lower the vibration of the planet so that they can survive here you know I've been talking about this the purpose of life is not to stress and the sooner we, we realize the purpose of life for one and all, because the purpose of life is equal for one and all. So the purpose of life to the ants is equal to the purpose of life to the human. Nobody purpose no greater than nobody purpose. You see? 
that's why there's only one purpose and it's evolution. And with evolution, no bad mind no come, no greed no come, no envy no come. You get to me, I say? Because there is no competition in evolution. Now when I bring other things now into the thing and I make people think so the purpose of life is to make money. People start compete, people start doing bag of things, people start dating each other. And, and, you know, I just a domino effect and these people know how the human mind works. They know how to get enough for war, they know how to get enough for eat each other. And then they bring in something for get enough for do it. And it's the monetary system. You know, so nothing is wrong with the monetary system. You have to just understand it and understand, understand say, you know, for envy nobody. And, but enough people don't get it. That means it not work. You get what I say? Because if everybody can get something, it means it not really work. If everybody not understand, say yo, they, they for make money and not envy people, and that the purpose of life is not just to make money, but it actually to be happy and you know to stress over trying to make money, and you know for you know. So now you realize it. People just think that the purpose of life is just to make as much money as possible, and that is not the purpose of life. The purpose of life is to live, be happy evolve you know and experience you know have a nice experience while they're here of the most you know most fulfilling experience while they're here that's it not to worry and stress over things when you don't really need you know melanated beings not even need food for survival so the freak you want work for <laughs> you don't need food for survival I'm telling you this melanated beings we even feed from the sun we don't need food for survival, so then you have to stress out yourself about make money for do what? For feed your family, and your family don't need food for survival. You know? So we really have work for you. Know, so I, I, I support a slavery system, a system where I feel, a system where I go out the door. That's all that you're doing, you know? So wake up people and realize the purpose of life is to be happy. And if your job not making you happy, it means you need to stop work. And if no job is making you happy, it simply just means you're not working at all. We're not coming here for work, you're probably coming here to do something else. You know? <laughs> it's simple. We got the journey YouTube channel once more. One love.